done fell in love with your eyes. I done fell in love, love. I done fell in love with your eyes. I done fell in love with your What's up you guys, welcome to my channel, my name is Kier, but I go by Keeks, Keeks on a B, Keeks with a Chicks, Kiwi, whichever one is fine with me. Today I'm going to be showing you guys this braided wig. I'm kind of like indifferent on it, I'm not even lying, I don't know. I'm a little indifferent on it, but I will say though, I really do like the way the wig game is changing because like this is very much a convenience wig. Like, you mean to tell me I can get some braids in 30 minutes as opposed to sitting 8 hours? Of course, of course I'm gonna try this out. We're gonna get into the video. I'll, I'll be telling you guys my thoughts throughout the video. You'll see how this wig performs. You'll see the construction and all of that good stuff. I got this wig from Sam's Beauty. I don't even know the name of the damn wig. I know it's this particular style. They're braided down to the sides and then in the back they're box braids. But like I said, we'll get into the construction and all that stuff. So we're just gonna get into the video so you guys see what I'm talking about. I never ever received a wig in this type of packaging. It's kind of cute. I don't know what WSD is, but that's the style of this wig. Here's the catalog. I'm just, I don't know. Sometimes, sometimes the catalog pictures don't be it. Like, she's not selling this for me. Like, I kind of want to try this for myself, but like, if I was to be trying to purchase based off like the catalog pictures, I would not purchase this wig. Cause, girl. It's cute, but mm. see if I can sell this wig for y'all because oh girl in the catalog, no shame, no offense, but it's not giving. Okay, let's get into the construction of this wig. So it was constructed with a medium brown lace. So like, if you're my complexion, a little bit darker than you good to go. If you're on a lighter side, don't even waste your time trying to buy this wig unless they have like a transparent version. The knots are not bleached at all but they like mm, they're not that big but if you all up on my face and if you all up in my business then of course you will see the knots also just like the braids they okay they kind of cute i personally like the real tight braids you could tell these were loosely braided but they were tight if that makes any type of sense i like my braids to look super tight like the actual braid not like it being tight I don't even know if that makes sense, but if it makes sense, I hope so. Yeah, I'm all up in this camera. Let me zoom back. My head already fit. All the braids are braided down to the side, and then the back. Oh. Okay, so they like threaded the braids so that they can stay together. I hope y'all can see that. Can y'all see? Yeah, you can see the thread. You see the thread right there? And don't mind my um my nails. I ain't been to nail shop. At the back, they're box braids, but. They're, they're on wefts. This is not even a full lace wig. Okay. They just did some of it. On the insides, what it looks like. Oh, they kind of like snap with the construction though. I ain't gonna lie, cause like, I thought you had to have a full lace wig in order to do like wig braids. Well, I mean, a braided wig. So this is the inside. It has an adjustable strap and then it has two combs that you can um, attach to your head. Well, really three. Two on the side and one at the bottom. So far, it looks decent. I'm I'm going to put this little cap on. I'm not gonna glue it down or anything like that. I just simply wanna see if we will be able to see the cap. So we will see if it's even necessary to wear a cap with this damn wig. So, y'all hear my mom. Every time I try to film, right? So I'm just put her on just like this. I'm not gonna adjust it or anything. I'm just put it on. Okay, so you can see the cap. If you wanna wear a cap to make it look more skin-like, then by all means. So let me take the cap off. And this kind of fit me pretty snug. I think I am gonna adjust it. Just so like it's super tight. Okay, but looking at it with my head, like with it on my head, It don't look like a wig. I would say though, I would, I would, I would prefer for the parting to be a little bit big, because I know for me naturally when I braid my hair, my parting is be big. Like my parting space, you can see the parts. If it was up to me, my parts would be like, you know, I could see them type shit. So I'm just gonna um install this little baby, and we're gonna come back with the final thoughts.
Okay, I can't use my blow dryer no more because I keep blowing the fuse. So hopefully this is dry. Just pluck in the baby hairs because it's a lot that they left out. This is probably gonna make a break this week because the baby hairs tell it all, man. Okay, y'all. So this is this is what we got. This is it. I don't know, man. I think this was supposed to be like this is made to be like a side part wig because when I put it on and tried to put it from ear to ear, the freaking part will not stay in the middle. So I know y'all see what I'm saying. Also, let me put something in this part so it can look a little bit believable. But yeah, when I was trying to put it ear to ear, but make the part in the middle, this side of my um hair will be showing so like from ear to ear the part really is not in the middle at least for me i don't know if it's going to be different if your head is like smaller than mine or whatnot but yeah that was something that i came across while putting this wig on and then also the baby hairs was definitely the hardest part i'm not even satisfied with these baby hairs you could definitely tell it's the wig but like i said the baby hairs are gonna make a break your install for sure uh-oh should i even do this Part in this so damn small, like. mm. But yeah, the baby hairs are gonna make or break your install. I'm really not a fan of my baby hairs. I don't think I ever am, honestly. This is how the wig is looking. Let me show you guys the back. Hopefully you guys don't see my ponytail. I don't think you can unless I go like this. But yeah, this is how it looks in the back. Uh, I'll try to like part it so you guys can see that it's wefted. It's not a full lace wig at all. It's wefted and then they also sew, um, they put a piece of thread through it so that the braids can stay together. The wig is super lightweight too, y'all. Like it's not heavy at all, which is a good thing. The hair don't itch in the length that, you know how some braiding hair be itchy? It doesn't, 
I don't know if they washed it in uh, vinegar or anything like that, but like the actual hair itself isn't like itchy or anything like that. The hair is super lightweight, not too many braids. It doesn't even feel like it's a wig on my head for real, for real. You could style this wig, but it's very limited due to the fact that they braided it down to the side. So this was basically like the intended style. So this is the already style wig, but you could definitely uh, put it to the bag. You can definitely finesse a few ponytails. Certain ponytails you probably won't be able to finesse as much because the back is not full lace, it's wefted. It. But um, yeah, you could definitely finesse a few ponytails. You could throw a little some twist in there and all that good stuff. I would say it's a pretty versatile wig, even though it's already styled. Overall, I really do like the idea of this because 30 minutes as opposed to six hours, six, seven, eight hours. I'll take it like and I'm the type of person that don't wear my braids long anyways because that little voice in my head be telling me to take it down to see how much my hair grew so like this is very convenient for me like if I could make the baby hair look more believable then definitely I would be like wearing units like this for sure dang I should have some accessories what am I doing keeks you know how they um with regular wigs they give you like the little hair wraps they give you the cap and they throw in some eyelashes every now and again I feel like the braided wigs they should come with accessories I'm not even gonna lie to you like they only like a dollar I mean I could go get it myself but then I would just be like in the situation that I'm in now, like it's an inconvenience because I can't go get it right now because I'm already doing the video, duh. But um, yeah, if you guys like this video, let me know. Leave me a comment down below what you think about it. Would you wear a braided wig? If you guys want me to review more braided wigs, like in different styles, let me know. If this video gets to about, I want to say like 50 likes, I'll do my own personal knotless braid wig i'll show you guys how to do those because i definitely be um making those along with the full log wigs i'll come on here with one of those videos soon but yeah get this video to 50 likes if you're feeling it and you want to see the knotless braid tutorial i think i'm gonna do it regardless though the 50 likes but i just need to know if y'all tuned in and this the type of content y'all want to see so let me know let me know but don't forget to subscribe to my channel turn on your post notifications and as always i'll see y'all in my next one bye 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 bye